Welcome to Vag Hacker. Proof you can hack the Vag anywhere. So, I go to get a manicure and yeah, pedicure. All right, you got feet just got to look clean. All right, but anyway, and all of a sudden I get this Asian chick, and then she says, "Oh no, appointment, appointment!" And the Asian chick runs over to somebody else, and I see this amazing girl, this fucking hot Latina, right? And it's really hard to take a picture without looking like a weirdo, right? But I'm like, holy fuck, I thought she was a customer. She comes over, and I'm like, oh, oh this is going to be crazy. So I'm sitting there. I'm acting uninterested. I mean, this girl is, guys, this picture does not do you justice, okay, uh, of this girl. Her face, everything dead on, unbelievable, right? So I'm like, wow, mm, what are we going to do here? So I take my Bluetooth out. Very light conversation. I'm like, Psst. so how do you feel working with um all these Chinese people here? Well, she goes, oh no, I like them. I've worked with them a long time. I'm like really? And then I, that one thing led to another. I don't know, but I didn't really make my move. I was planting seeds. Okay, you don't say you're beautiful, this or that. Okay, I wanted to find out information. This is when you put on your double or seven hat. Okay, and you're like, so, um, so I found out she had a kid, right? And I told her my story. She goes, Oh, yeah, that was like me too. So, in other words, she wasn't married, she's not seeing anybody, right? Without me asking, Hey, can I get your number or any bullshit like that? Now that I've cleared the runway, okay, we're sitting down now. I know it's the part where she's got to do the manicure. She's holding my hand, she's looking at my hand. So, I'm like, um, like, what's your name? So she tells me. I tell her my name. She goes, that's very Italian. I said, I know. I said, listen, I got cream and stuff all over my hands. I'm going to give you my phone to put your phone number in there. I said, and I don't need the number at a spa. Your phone number. She ever so gently takes my phone. Not only is she kind enough to put in her phone number, okay, she even types in her name. All right, now I'm like, this is smoking. I text her my name. Let's see if she dissed me. She got it right away. Boom. Now we had the connection, the text. So usually you want to wait right away, but I got my kid coming tomorrow. Then it's going into Christmas. You put these things off, you lose opportunity. So against my better judgment, and she didn't even know I had a Lambo. Against my bed, because I had my regular car, right? Against my better judgment, I send her a text message, okay? Asking, oh, this is her texting me now. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Woo! All right. So, anyway, I, um, I'm like, so listen, what time you finish work? Here's what I sent her. What time you finish work? You want to grab a casual drink or something? Sounds odd, I know, but I have my son from tomorrow, and then it's Christmas, and then by then you'll forget, and I'm pretty awesome. That's why I actually sent her. You know, she sent me back. Okay, perfect. I finished around 7.30. I said, that's great. I'll see you then. I'll still be in the area, right? So she's like, where are we going, casual, or do I have to change, right? I said, we could go casual, right? And then... The whole time, when we, she's joking around me, she's like, she's like, when she does my feet, my toes, she's like, you want shiny buff? I said, no. And then we sit down, and she looks at me, she goes, what color? I said, babe, you got to be fucking kidding me. So just now I got even with her. I said, I tell you what, now you pick a color. Don't think. Just black or blank, because I don't want you to know the color of the car that I'm going to pick her up in tonight, okay? And she picks blank, okay? And you know what blank is? The fucking Lambo. So, <sighs> I don't know if there's going to be some kind of gap here. I'm going to fill the gap is all I can see. This worked like fucking butter. The average guy would have sat there 
with his fucking iPad on and everything else. And you know what? If I upload this now, I have time to do it as a live premiere. I'm telling you, this is like like one of the fucking Jenna girls, okay? And I was like embarrassed. And then I was like, wait a minute. I'm a boy. Look, you could see nipple right there, right? I'm like, stay like that. Don't get dressed. That looks easy. Anyway, um, yeah. So I got about T minus one hour. I'm going to try to upload this fast. Bye.